This is a cross-list earth science and biology class called Global Biogeochemical Cycles. It's also part of the environmental studies curriculum at Rice. My name is Lewis Allback. I'm going to be the historical narrator of this uh, tour. For the first time this year, we're gonna uh, we're gonna we're gonna have a field unit on watershed sustainability, and the students will travel to four different sites with four different uh, professionals, people who think about sustainability in water from 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 different angles. When I grew up here, we never looked at this bayou. It was it was just there. It was never considered an asset to the city in terms of beauty or recreation or uh, you know just in terms of being a nice waterway it was always very utilitarian this first trip was about the the history of buffalo bayou and how how houstonians have thought about sustainability and buffalo bayou over uh, over the very long term over over a 150 year time scale i think a professor wanted us to see the uh, public health viewpoints, the environmental viewpoints, the economic value of this bayou system, kind of what's actually been happened in reaction to all of the recent discoveries in biogeochemical science and kind of the response to that that this community has made. Yeah, I thought the, the tour guide, he had exactly the right idea that you see a very different perspective from the water level that you do looking, looking down you get a better sense of what it might have looked like before they, they added all of, the, all of the buildings. The bayou was a really central part of economic sustainability in Houston in the uh, 19th and early 20th century. It was, it was the central economic route for the, for the city and for this part of Texas. I think we saw that really well here. And now we're sort of in a process, I thought the, um, the historian did a great job of describing how we're transitioning from from a 19th, early 20th century view of the bayou as an economic waterway to something that's going to provide a different kind of economic development, providing green space and parks to stimulate redevelopment of, of, of the east end of the city. 